A federal judge on Wednesday cleared the way for Detroit to follow through with its bankruptcy. Firefighters, bus drivers, and other city workers had sued, fearing they could lose their pensions if the city reorganized. As this case is so monumental, it sets precedent for the country. If you start with the Motor City, who helped build this country, and you take the hard-working blue-collar workers' pensions, then yes, it can spread across the country. The court ruling is a victory for Michigan Governor Rick Snyder and Detroit Emergency Manager Kevin Orr. Orr's spokesman was optimistic the ruling would allow city leaders to eventually bring Detroit to financial solvency through Chapter 9 bankruptcy. We can start to move forward with, with getting, getting into the meat of the issue. That's not going to happen for a couple months yet in court. Detroit is the largest city in American history to declare bankruptcy. The city is in financial trouble, partly because of a big decline in the number of people who live in the city, thus a big drop in tax revenue. Ted Chaffrey, Associated Press, Detroit.